Hey friends, welcome to my channel. It's Rachel here and today I am sharing some Happy Mail packages that I am sending out and this really brings me back to when I first started Happy Mail and they were much more simple. They were envelopes, they were letters, they were just little pieces of ephemera or stickers and this is still a lot more than what I started off sending seven years ago when I started but um but yeah, it still brings me back to that time. So I'm gonna share everything in here, what I'm sending and why. So let's go through it. Let's start with this one. So let me give you a little background on this package. I am participating in the Scrapbook and Cards Today um, Crop and Create event online. And um, I was actually supposed to go to the one in May of 2020, but obviously it got canceled. Anyway, this package is going to Laurel because Laurel was very helpful in um, helping me like sign up and if I should go and all that stuff. And we're going to kind of like do the event virtually together as much as we can. Um, and we actually did a swap back in the fall. I sent her something and then, you know, she had a baby, so she got a little bit busy. Uh, but she is, she has just sent me something that I'm sure will be up on my, my channel soon. Uh, but I wanted to send her something as well. She, she said she was in, including some like, uh, crop starter package or care package or something like that. So I told her I'd send her some things for the weekend. So let me go through that and show you what I've sent her. And I was also in the States a couple weeks ago. We're in Canada, if you don't know. And I picked up some candy, some chocolate bars for both of us to try that we don't have here, just for fun. So that's what this first thing is. The first thing is a payday chocolate bar. And I just grabbed this paper, did some sewing, stapled it, put some twine. It's simple, easy, but cute. And then I have this little, I don't know, care package for her that I just love. And I made something similar for the other one. And the theme that I was going for... Um, with these packages is like a pocket full of sunshine. That's kind of what I was going for here. Sorry, I've had to <laughs> stop and start this video so many times. I've actually made this video um, multiple times and I've had issues with recording it and the video footage. Um, so I, I apologize if this video is choppy, but I really wanted to do this video. Okay, so yes, the theme for this is pocket full of sunshine. And so I put this cute little um, crinkle paper at the bottom or shred or whatever you want to call it from Walmart. And then I got this little hand sanitizer that says girls support girls. I know we're just doing it at home, so she doesn't really need hand sanitizer, but I thought it was cute. And then some chapstick. I gave her some sequins uh, mixed from my shop. That's Nemo. I just thought it matched with everything. And then I put this little sticker on top of this test tube that I got from Amazon because, well, I accidentally got ones that were way too big and now I'm trying to find ways to use it up. Um, I decided to put some embroidery floss in there. Um, I just thought it looked cute. And then, of course, a chocolate bar as well. And then I have included this little starburst and some straws if she wants to use them for crafting or actual straws or whatever. In this bag, I have a mug cake that she can make on the weekend if she wants a little something easy to make, but something yummy. And then I made this little sequin box for her. Um, oh, I love that. It makes me so happy. Um, this is something I made on my Patreon. My links will be down below. These are from CRG Art Design. And then I got her some bubble gum just in case she wanted to chew some gum while she crafts. I got her face mask if she needs to relax at the end of a busy crafting day. These are from the that collaboration with Target, that Stony Clover Lane collaboration. My husband was actually over the border the day it came out and I was seeing it everywhere on Instagram and I'm like, you need to get these things. So they were affordable, they're cute. I thought they'd make a good addition. And then I also included these little alphas if she wanted them. I know she likes holographic things, so I think she does at least. So I thought this would be fun to include. Not that she'll need more craft supplies, but you know. So that's all that's going in that little package. And then here is the other one. This is to a friend who for a while has been going through a hard time and she's a good friend to me. And over Christmas, she sent me a beautiful gift. And so I wanted to spoil her a little bit as well. So. Um, where she is in the world, it is autumn right now, so I thought I would make it a little bit more autumn themed, um, but not, you know, not in your face, but I made her one of these little care packages as well. So we have this little bag topper here, 
Um, we have a tag flip, a chapstick, and um, uh, hand sanitizer, kind of the same formula or similar formula as the other one. So you can see them here, pretty similar. And this tag flip, actually I'll open it, this tag flip, um, she requested me to make it on my Patreon because she is a patron of mine. And so I made it because that was her request. And so I thought it'd be fun to send it to her. So this is on my Patreon as a video if you want to see it. I have, um, it's kind of like my YouTube channel, but more um, extended longer videos over there. If you want to join over on my Patreon. And then I just made this little, the paper clip is from CRG Art Design. And then I just added those little letters onto it. Okay, so that all goes back in there. I still have to write cards, but um, I will get to that. Um, I added a mug cake for her as well. And then I have these two memory decks cards for her that are kind of fall themed. And then I have two Starbursts for her that are really cute. She also gets a pretty face mask. And then because she is in my Patreon, all my patrons got a free sequin mix in the month of March. So um, I included that in her package, a little candy and a thank you card. And then this isn't really fall-ish, but I thought it would be fun anyway. I've been making lots, sorry about my nails, my nails are chipping, but I've been making a lot of sequin things lately. So I wanted to show her what I've been working on and send her some. So that is her package. I think it's all going to fit in there. Um, I guess we'll try and add it in right now. Let's try and put it together. I hope it'll all fit. Let's put the flat things in first. I think it will all fit. <laughs> I'm going to put some crinkle paper and then the cards. Um, so hopefully everything is pretty flat. And this is my encouragement to you. I know that um, Happy Meal can be kind of intimidating because you see these grand boxes that are just crazy, but I would encourage you start small and um, you don't have to go big. You can just stick to bubble mailers or envelopes and it's just as well. Okay, so it actually all fit. That's fantastic. Let's do the other one. Oh, we had something come off here. So I will have to fix that. Okay, let's package this one. This one is a little bit smaller, so I don't have doubts about it fitting. Okay, it just has the giant chocolate bar and the box, but I think we should be okay here. I think it'll still all fit. It does, so I just gotta finish up the packaging, but there are my two packages. I'm gonna put their addresses on it, decorate with like, just, you know, random stickers, not anything crazy. I just have sticker books and like to cover the fronts of packages. Going to put a little bit of crinkle paper if it, if it fits. If not, it doesn't necessarily need it. And a card. So that's it for my video today. Thank you so much for watching. I'm so glad I eventually got through it because I had a rough start after restarting filming multiple times. Um, I hope you're enjoying my 30 days of videos. I still have more videos coming up and you, you know, you can catch up as well on videos you may have missed. I've done a very, you know, a good variety of videos. So anyway, I hope you have been enjoying this. I'll have all the links down below for my Patreon, sequel mixes, Instagram, all the things. Thank you so much for watching um, and hope you have a great day. Bye.